While Chrono basically shouts at us, Luca is just sitting reading a book. That's my Luca. Wait, what? <laughs> hey, everybody, Klaus here. Welcome back for more Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Last time, we found out that we were warped to the past, only to find that Meryl has disappeared due to being a member of the royal family in, the, in our timeline due to history changing. This time, well, we're going to be going after, well, the queen that has been taken, obviously the cathedral, because where else would she be taken? <laughs> but, before I go there, I just want to show off that um, I have updated my equipment off screen. I have equipped um, Chrono here with the um, bronze medal that I got in the previous episode that I didn't notice for some reason. I've also got um, Luca here, the dark gun, as well as a bronze, bronze helm. And uh, she does have this size cup that allows her to see in the HP. But, that's not all. I want to show us something new. Look at learn Flame Toss, which hits, uh, which hits all enemies in a direct line of, well, from her location anyway. There's also something that new here. Dual Tech. This is a tech combined by two characters to make a, well, single attack, often stronger. Now, Luca is the first of her kind to use elemental attacks. This is, this is fire. And I also want you to make notice something as well. Notice how each character has a different tag. This one has, this one, Luca. He's the element of fire. And Chrono Lightning. This becomes actually really important later on. So you're gonna wanna remember that for much later. Just trust me, it's not important now, but it will be later. For now, with all the preparations out of the way, well, not quite, I'm gonna heal Chrono's MP because I was too dumb not to do that off screen. No, not really. That was a fault on my part. No one to blame but me. But, for real. Why are you reading a book? We're heading into the cathedral. <laughs> she started reading as soon as I got to the door. That was pretty funny. I want nothing but world peace. Or a piece of the world. Yeah, and you're a lily budget. I doubt you're gonna ever be able to do that. I want to stick around for the organ recital. It's a real killer. If it's that good, I guess. Sure. People wouldn't know what to do with themselves in a truly peaceful world. My, what delicious. Er, I mean delightful looking human. Get away from me! Oh dear, looks like you could use some food in a place to press. See what I mean when I say this cathedral's creepy? After talking to her. Huh. Sparkly, workly, I want a shiny object! What'd you find? A hairpin. That's Guardian's Royal Crest. Oh my god, there are monsters this whole time! This is... Nuggets! Nuggets are really annoying, though the first ending of the kind to inflict slow. Which yes. is really annoying, slow, it does when it's advertised in the box, slow you down. But there's a great opportunity to show Flame Toss. From where she's standing, she'll attack all enemies straight in a row. And as you know it, these Nuggets have really crap magical defense. Yes. This is counted as a magical attack. Spell spell. You idiot! You've already slowed her down! Seriously, these nuggets are morons! <laughs> Complete morons! Oh well. 
I could use a flame toss to get rid of this one. I don't find it overly necessary. See, down they go. Oh. Yeah, there. And if an enemy is up close to a um cure, they'll take some of the alternate, uh, alternate weaker weapon and just kind of bash them. They're not as strong up close as they are far away from the enemy. Who oh, else close? That was a cheap shot. That frog is badass! Lower thine guard, and thou art allowing the enemy in. Thou art here to save the queen? This is why I prefer the PS1 version of the DS version. The, um, old English is awesome! Really dumb that they removed it in the DS version. That was so the core of this character. Yeti! The layer is deep with thing. Will V accompany me? Eh, a frog! Grow, sucking frog! I hate frogs! My guys doth not inquire that trust. Very well. Do as thee please, but I shall save the queen. Wait. You don't seem like a bad er person frog thing. I mean Kono, what should we do? Let's go with the frog. I'll just have to handle it. I mean do with him. You realize he's within earshot, right? What's her name? Same as ironically, frog. Yeah, frog. <laughs> Even with an uncreative name, he's still awesome. Frog will do. Look at flexing his muscles. Check out my biceps. My biceps are ten times bigger than going in my strangle. <laughs> that, that is totally random. All right, nice to meet you, frog. Mayhap a hen door lurks nigh. Let us search the in in nevers. Well, that one nugget mentioned something about organ recital. Let's play it. That's a well-hidden door, if I may say so. It's hidden inside. Welcome to what the cathedral is really like. Yeah. I have a couple of monsters here that I'm going to take out. Such as these three goggles. These goggles aren't really all that... I did a Diablos! I'm confusing him for a later enemy. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. We'll go right here because he needs it the most. And I'm gonna do flame toss to take take out these two Diablos. Or at least do a fair amount of damage to these uh, Diablos. I guess. Alright, I'll take it out. And it Yeti. do that. I guess they're technically a bit stronger, but they would sell. They're still basic enemies. Not all that much to worry about. We do get a fair amount of money off of them. Might be good to grind off of, I guess, if you if you're um a bit short on cash. Eh, uh, for the record, I'm against something. Uh, on a personal standpoint. Whatever. Not sure. Uh, as Yeti. far as I remember, recalled, I believe... No. no. Ah, what am I even saying here? 
There is an enemy variant like this that'll devour other enemies and just kind of crawl. Why do you eat your comrades? And wow, I'm seriously saying comrades! I swear I'm not a communist. Better <laughs> right, I just like the sound of that word. Comrades! Ooh, nice, we got a revive off of those guys. Very nice. Alright. It's awesome to get a revive for free. Whatever, and here. <gasps> hey, what's with the disguise? No need for them here. Yeah, these monsters actually think we're them, so they all click talk to us. It's almost my ship. I hate pretending to be human. It's so repulsive. I'm with you there, bra. I'm with you there. Like, seriously, human life is this. Mm. Especially so this how dumb humanity's gotten. I mean, look at all the shit that we complain about. <coughs> the ones we ate recently weren't so bad. Those two soldiers we caught look rather plump and juicy. Thanks for being creepy there, Nugget. Your are so smart. His plan to capture the Chancellor and take his place were perfectly. Now the Queen's captive. The castle's in uproar. This is rich. And he just falls over. I'll look at a Magus' statue before my shift. Magus' statue, you say? You want to look in on the statue ourselves, so we ought to follow this Diablos. And inside here, and... What in the who and the hey, the what in the how and the what? A soldier here, the king and the queen? Yeah, I don't buy it. What are you right here? Whoa, I swear that was not intentional! I don't buy it, I get a hundred G. Are you here to save Queen Leany? Oh, what a relief. Sorry, the king. How nice of you to come. I'm sure your crow will be just as pleased. Why not rest in here until he's available? And the queen, no need for you to come rest to me. Master Yakra is very kind. So I stay here and I'll let you make yourselves a home too. Now that is really odd. But we're gonna head to the left. That's right, to the right. Ugh. Sometimes getting confused. Oh, dearest Magus. Your flashing eyes like stars. And your flowing hair like rains atop the sea. No sad, sad danger. Her fr any frightful, bright place can get us down. As long as you're near. There's nothing to fear. Magus, oh Magus, I hear a oh, Magus. Come join us and sing in your funeral degree. Ha ha ha! These enemies there, yeah, they see us for, for what we really are. Well, the Diablos didn't fight us before. I don't know. I don't care. I'll take it. Okay. Frog here. Has slurp for his first tech. Auto log. Uh, uh, auto unlock, nonetheless. I'm gonna make it show it off. Yeah. Sticking out its tongue to heal. Okay. It's worth creepy, but at least it helps recover us. Yeah, baby! Anyway, not only is this a good spot to gain some some extra experience points, which is always welcome. That's not all I came here for. Come on, move it. 
Yeah, Chrono's more reliable than you, Frog. Okay, to be fair, he was on the slow, but seriously. Oh, well. There actually is a rather awesome statue of Lord Magus. And I'll think it's under a bright light. Okay, you got a speed belt here. And a defender. Two really good, um, I, I wouldn't say really good, but two good accessories nonetheless. You know what I think I can do without the sight scope and give Luke a little more defense. It is nice seeing enemy HP. I can work without it. Anyway, that being done. Try to leave. Or at least have to hurry. Enjoy yourselves first. Yeah. They're all really monsters. <gasps> Who saw that coming? Okay, now that's actually a good chance to show... Firewall. Oh. Awkward attack execution is awkward. I wasn't paying attention and thought I was targeting all three of them. I, uh, uh, I have no I have no choice but to take the game's word for it that I wasn't actually targeting all three enemies. Okay. Oh well. We go around these gargoyles here. I devils! God damn it! Ugh. Oh my god. Yeah. It happens to me every time I play this game. I always call the diablos here gargoyles for whatever reason. It's really annoying to break that habit. To this building. There's room, there's a room dedicated to Magus. Heard something about a treasure there. Okay. You're humans. There ain't the queen in the back. Please rescue her. It seems you guys are legitimate um, soldiers. We're nice. Well, what's really nice is a power tab. Right there. So we got, we got another power tab. Really, really good find. Right there. Alright, I'm gonna head down here and into the, this room right over here. Three other chests. One of them, a main suit. Really nice equipment for Meryl. And an ether as well as a potion. Not bad, not bad at all. Check this. Found the secret Nogate. Brahme. Hey everyone, humans! They're after the Brahme! Get them! Alright, there's a new enemy right here! Hank! The most badass name ever! No seriousness though. This is, um, one enemy that can actually reposition you on the map. The area is not all that big, so it's not likely to happen, but... These are enemies, indeed, that can't yeah, do that. Just knock those two out right away with the flame toss. Really good getting an insta-kill on those guys. Very nice. There we go. Yeah, they do have an attack that can pick you up and throw you across the room. Ooh, nice slurp cut. And cross strike! Yes! That's my favorite dual tech. I cannot wait to show that off. They've kicked the door again. 
Nothing. All it does is spawn in new enemies. It's not an actual, um, item. See, it doesn't even show up on the, um, item. Thing. It's just a, it's just a thing that, um, spawns in enemies. Which is kinda nice, I guess. As far as I know, that doesn't actually do anything. Uh, if you correct me down in the comments, that'd be really great. But as far as I know, that doesn't do anything. But it's fun if you hit this. Okay, so what I'm going to be doing here is I'm going to be taking on all these enemies um, off screen. That is, if I can somehow avoid them. Yes, I can! So I'm going to be taking them on off screen. Actually, I'm going to take this time to um, end this video off here, as there is a save point. So, I guess next time on Let's Play Chrono Trigger, we'll be going deeper in the cathedral, and with you, the real Queen Lee. See you guys there.